Solemnity of Epiphany of the Lord Lord, every nation on earth will adore you. This day's Gospel is from Matthew 2, 1-12. Now after Jesus was born in Bethlehem of Judea in the days of Herod the king, behold, wise men from the east came to Jerusalem, saying, Where is he who has been born king of the Jews? For we saw his star when it rose and have come to worship him. When Herod the king heard this, he was troubled, and all Jerusalem with him, and assembling all the chief priests and scribes of the people, he inquired of them where the Christ was to be born. They told him, In Bethlehem of Judea, for so it is written by the prophet. And you, O Bethlehem, in the land of Judah, are by no means least among the rulers of Judah. For from you shall come a ruler, who will shepherd my people Israel. Then Herod summoned the wise men secretly and ascertained from them what time the star had appeared. And he sent them to Bethlehem, saying, Go and search diligently for the child, and when you have found him, bring me word, that I too may come and worship him. After listening to the king, they went on their way. And behold, the star that they had seen when it rose went before them until it came to rest over the place where the child was. When they saw the star, they rejoiced exceedingly with great joy. And going into the house, they saw the child with Mary his mother, and they fell down and worshipped him. Then, opening their treasures, they offered him gifts, gold and frankincense and myrrh. And being warned in a dream not to return to Herod, they departed to their own country by another way. This is the Gospel of the Lord. Matthew 2, 1-12 holds profound significance in Jesus' birth narrative. Guided by a star, the Magi fulfill ancient prophecies about the Messiah's birthplace, highlighting his role as Savior. Recognizing Jesus as King of the Jews underscores his universal importance, while gifts of gold, frankincense, and myrrh symbolize his royalty, divinity, and mission. The narrative contrasts humble magi with fear-driven King Herod, revealing divine plan versus human power. The guiding star showcases God's providence, guiding seekers to Jesus. Obedience to divine revelations emphasizes guidance importance. In essence, this passage encapsulates prophecy fulfillment, divine revelation, worship, and universal impact, inviting reflection on Jesus' arrival. So let us pray. Gracious Heavenly Father, as we reflect on the Magi's journey to find Jesus, we're reminded of their reverence and determination. Just as they sought Him, we seek a deeper connection with You, embracing the universal message of salvation that His birth brings. Guide us, Lord, to approach You humbly and to offer our hearts in worship. Grant us wisdom to follow Your guidance, especially when the path is unclear. Help us discern Your voice amid life's distractions. Lead us to prioritize Your divine purposes over earthly desires. May our lives reflect the sacrificial love exemplified by Jesus, as we extend gratitude for His fulfillment of prophecies and His redemptive impact. In Jesus' name, we pray. Amen. Type Amen if you feel blessed.